now it's time for more or less play not Final Fantasy 2. And let's go for the same door twice. I hate it when they do that. Have it sort of by going the same direction, you're going to loop. Oh well. Ah, you've been tricked. It's the Earth Crystal from Final Fantasy 1. Oh, for the love of... Why did I never see this coming? Plus, even if he was honest and gave Rosa back, it wouldn't change the fact he has a crystal. I honestly prefer the burden of seeing a different Final Fantasy game. Probably because I like the character involved much better. But here's a funny thing. He's technically about to use more than 99 M 90 MP, his Mac, because he knows he uses fire free, lit free, and ice free, which use 90 MP in total. He cast some spells before that. So it can't be as simple as using a spell that costs more MP than you have for it to be dangerous. So obviously it's something about Meteor itself, and it's just the 99 MP thing was only really there as a plot device to prevent you from using it early. I don't doubt or inconsistent about something. I guess it's okay to use spells without MP. So long as you're in a cutscene, they're not too strong for you. So it's probably plausible that with cutscene power, Telecraft casts fire free all day almost. And the meal may or may have destroyed him. But it certainly made him fall down. It makes Cain fall down too. He fainted. He likes lightning the best, doesn't he? And because Cecil's no longer wearing his armor, nobody can get a closer look at him. And he hesitates. Okay, so he wants us to do the very thing that got him killed, injured, and so forth. That makes perfect sense. I died from sticking a fork in an electric socket. You must stick a fork in an electric socket. And what's more, we don't have to clean up the body. Here we go. Well, that's a quick rope untying. It's just more dramatic than that. And Ken can't bear to watch. Yet yeah, says watch and I 
I think it's probably out of jealousy, but he's probably also worried what might happen if he wasn't where well, he could keep an eye on her, although keeping her close wasn't exactly keeping her safe either. Good. I actually have a much better party now than we had before. An actual white wizard with good MP and manageable. And that's what the game can trip you up for the first time. And you might not realize that Rosa's equipment is terrible. This is especially bad if you were to say move forward without equipping her. Because. Yay, it's a boss battle time. Well, it's obviously going to be a boss battle. The four fiends. Yeah. I would jerk with them smacking the head on someone else. As if Meteor was the only dangerous spell in the game. And of course, it's bragging time. Yeah. The problem with fighting her is you miss a lot while she's still spinning. Sheesh. So it's just best to have Kane jump and wait a bit. He uses weak way too much. And now fight. I'm gonna berserk him. Just keep him jumping regardless. It's not like those children don't really do much else. I should have stocked up on items. Not sure if he'll get rid of the berserk stats or not. I guess I'll find out soon enough. One way or the other. It's best to keep Kane jumping regardless whether she's spinning or not. Because by the time he lands, she'll probably be in spin form again anyway. But sometimes you can damage her when she's spinning regardless. But yeah, mostly for this battle, just like berserking everyone I can. And then hoping for the best. The only ones I don't berserk are Kane, so he can keep jumping, and Rosa, so she can keep healing. And that went pretty, pretty fast. And seriously, I expected her to last longer. 
This berserk does help a lot. Yet another spell gets me as part of the plot. I really can't have many spells get used as part of the plot eventually. Uh, other crystals. The dark crystals. Which you would probably have seen come if you played another Final Fantasy game from the past. Before it's been a game you didn't get that Final Fantasy because they had to skip forward. Yay, maybe we can actually protect the crystal for once. Underground, of course. To the moon, Alice. Yes. And we'll figure what that place is next time. So, bye for now.